Tonight, we're sharing a story which is tough for most people to watch. A little baby diagnosed with a rare sickness. The Norman family's journey is being followed by thousands thanks to social media. Just one of their videos has nearly 70,000 views. Their medical battle and the generosity of South Alabama have captured our attention. As News 5's Allison Spann shows us tonight, the family is relying on their faith when it comes to their baby's fight to beat cancer. Let me kiss my breath, Dad. Meet Tinley Ryan Norman. <laughs> she's pretty much changed everybody's life since she's been here. She's just a, a delight and just a, couldn't be a better grandbaby. Two weeks ago, Tinley was a healthy baby girl. Today, she's at MD Anderson meeting with oncologists trying to find answers. Her parents, high school sweethearts Jordan and Tanner, spoke with us over FaceTime from Houston. It's a malignant extrarenal rhabdoid tumor. Um, and that particular cancer is, um, she said, one of the hardest pediatric cancers to treat. She's been diagnosed with a cancer so rare, there's only about 100 cases nationwide each year. They've already removed a tumor from her bladder, but they fear it's spread to her lungs. Always got a smile on her face. And for her grandparents, it's hard to imagine their fun-loving grandbaby dealing with all of this. This has been extremely emotional. It's been this past weekend was one of my longest weekends. The family says the diagnosis is hard, but the outpouring of support from the community has been unbelievable. From a flight to Houston via Pilots for Christ. We were contacted by Pilots for Christ within about 30 minutes of learning her diagnosis and um, they were more than willing to fly us out here. To Tinley Tough t-shirts and wristbands being sold on Facebook, the family is grateful. Look, I've had several messages from people I've never met, um, just sending love and encouragement and saying that they've been encouraged uh, by the situation. And for now, everyone's trying to stay Tinley Tough. <laughs> We learned from the family today that Tinley's doctors at MD Anderson want to run a few more tests to verify that it is cancer they're seeing in her lungs. Friends of the family have started a GoFundMe page to help pay for Tinley's medical bills. You can find that link in this story on WKRG's website after the show. For now, live in the studio, Allison Spann, News 5.